Hi, I'm Janet Garrick. I live in Huntington Beach, California. Last Wednesday, I was in a, a special place and I happened to notice this um, lady, Livia. There was something about her that I felt I was actually driven to want to know who she was. There was a sparkle in her eye, a warmth, a feeling that she knew something that I wanted to know. And I don't know how that happens because it all, I don't know that it's almost ever happened to me. And so I took <laughs> took a little bit of courage and I walked up and said, who are you and why are you here? And I feel like I want to know you and I don't know why. And I'm a little embarrassed to tell you that. And she was so welcoming and very happy to tell me about why she was there. And she was there for a particular conference. And I said, why that? Why does that conference interest you? And she says, well, I'm, um, I have a dream that I'm fulfilling in my life, um, a way that I can reach out to others and help them discover things that I've been discovering in my own life that have really made the difference and how to pursue your own dreams with integrity to your belief systems, to find out who you really are. Well, that really spoke to me, really did, because I'm in my 70s and I have put off me for all those years tried to be a perfect mom, a, a wonderful husband, a good classroom teacher for 25 years. And I thought when I retire, I'm like, I will do all the things I dreamed of doing. And it's like when I retired, I died and I lost track of who I was. I didn't have that identity anymore. And I couldn't even remember all the things that I wanted to do anymore. And people would ask me, what are your dreams? What are your goals? And I said, I don't know. I had so many in my mind before I retired. And now I don't know what they are anymore. And I was kind of le leading, allowing other organizations in my life to determine what I might do for the final years of my life to have a meaningful existence. All of them are nice and they're all good things and they are all related to service, but they're not me. And um, I want to I want to know who I am. I feel like I lost that when I got married, but I'm not unhappy about that. But I had a different life and I needed to, to do that life with integrity and and do well by my family. And over the years I just lost me. And so then we've met again and I asked her, How can I know more about what you're doing and she introduced me to her website told me that she also works with individuals well I live in California and she lives in Utah but she does it on um, the internet which is perfect because then we don't have that transportation issue um, so I'm really I'm just beginning oh I also was thrilled to know how much she values doTERRA because my daughter introduced me to that and I had some really major new bilateral knee replacement surgery a year ago and doTERRA is what got me through it so I thought we have similar values we we have we want to consecrate our lives we want to do healthy things that are natural um, plus she just seems like a delightful person if I lived in the neighborhood I'd want to be her friend and so I'm really eager to get involved with her program I feel like it was an incredible blessing that we just happened to run into each other